Hi guys and welcome to another Divi WordPress theme tutorial. This is Jamie from System22 and WebDesignandTechTips.com. Well today we're working with the great Divi Supreme modules plugin and we're going to showcase this scrolling image module. If you've got a long image you can create a little module here that will showcase your image. It'll scroll down through it or you can scroll up if you prefer. Really handy little feature. It's great for showing off long images like that one of a website. Of course you can have another image that grabs people's attention and then at the bottom you can put a little call to action button on the image itself and have that link to something. I've got this one linking to a product. And this one I've just got a sort of WordPress logo and I've got it the pop out on this one you can actually watch a video and I've got it linking to a YouTube video and they support Vimeo and a couple of others as well just click on that and it pops out the video for you make sure it's gonna play yep yeah. there you go so there's three different flavors you can do with this module so let's get started um, I'm gonna enable the visual builder Divi's visual builder once loaded let's go down to where we are obviously I'm using the Divi theme here that's awesome if you want to take it for a test drive you can do so from my affiliate link below this video and here's our images let's just get rid of this one and we'll start again so I'm going to hit the add module button and it'll prompt us to add a module. Divi comes with loads of standards, all these light gray ones. And the purple ones there are the Divi Supreme ones, which we'll be using today. And you can check out the Divi Supreme from my affiliate link below the video also. So today we want a scrolling image. There it is, Supreme Scroll Image. I'm just going to click on that one. It'll put it in the column for us. Now I just need to select my image. And this works best, obviously, with long images. I'll just grab the one that I grabbed before. There it is. It's in there now. Now what do we want to link it to? Well last time I had this linked to a video. To do that it's very easy or you can link it to a product or another page. Just simply put in your image link right here or if you want it to open in a light box the whole image you can hit that one right there. So I'm going to use it as a video pop-up today. So I'm going to put that to yes. And I simply need to put my YouTube video link in there. So if I paste, I should still have it. There it is. I've just pasted in the YouTube video link there. Let's look over here to scroll settings. You can change the speed here. Or if you want to, you can have it reverse. You can have it go from uh, bottom to top. Or top to bottom. Obviously you don't need a background in there because I've got my image unless you want to make some scroll effects. Design wise there's really not much to do here. You can have an overlay if you want to. You can select the color of your light box. You can have padding obviously, box shadow and everything like that. Um, but for most things the only settings that I've messed with are the links and the actual scroll speed that's how easy it is so let's just save that one exit save our changes and exit the visual builder go down to where we want to work and let's see what we've got here we just built this one it's going to scroll down then on the actual image itself I've just put a call to action button and the whole thing should link to the video there we have it of course you can apply all the other normal animations and drop shadow box shadows to it if you want to 
That's how easy it is to add one of these with the Divi Supreme modules plugin. There's a free version and a pro version. And like I say, you can check it out from a, my affiliate link below this video. So I hope you've enjoyed that and found it useful. Once again, this has been Jamie from System22 and WebDesignAndTechTips.com. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.